<laughs> but uh, look, ladies and gentlemen, I want to leave you with a cautionary tale and also a hopeful note. The cautionary tale, I'm assuming most of you are old enough to remember the 1996 election. Yeah, That was between Paul Keating and John Howard. Now, history's been rewritten, but Keating was not a darling of the left then. He was not. He was far too right-wing economically. I was living in Perth and he came to speak and I went down to protest. Yes, I bloody did. Uh, I shaved my head for the occasion. My friend Freya got a purple mohawk. That was very important to my message. <laughs> so we went down to yell shit at the Prime Minister, as you do. Uh, but I tell you what, as soon as he started speaking, I was like completely mesmerised. Like, I don't know if my eyes did that, like, thing, but he had me at wet cabbage. <laughs> he really did. So he gives this amazing speech. There's, like, hundreds of people there. As soon as he finished, the crowd parted. He walked directly over to us and he said, ladies, what can I do for you? Now, being the articulate young woman I was, I went, oh. <laughs> Freya says to him, Paul, your waxwork statue in Madame Tussauds looks nothing like you. <laughs> to which he replied, I'll get on to it. <laughs> oh, Paul, I am so sorry we lost you the election. <laughs> <laughs>